welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Today, we are doing another hide-and-seek. However, unlike any other hide-and-seek, if you're in our Discord, which you most definitely should be, there's a link down below, by the way, I recently went onto our Discord and shared this map. That looks pretty normal. It looks like any other hide-and-seek map. Maybe a little bit bigger, because big, big is the name of the game today. How hard could it be if we played hide and seek only using Unimogs? I wish every single one of you good luck today because today is gonna be very, very interesting. Try to blend in with something. I've got different levels if for whatever reason this one becomes a little too difficult. Go build your Unimog, come back out, and we will begin hide and seek Unimog edition. So, I mean, my Unimog is just a, a basic Unimog. I mean, you guys do have some options for your build. If you are so brave, you can toss on a Forza splitter. You can have no bed in the rear, or you can toss that on. Why are there HREs on a Unimog? Don't worry about it. We just travel in style regardless of where we're going. I like the camouflage paint jobs, lads. We've got the Woody. We've got the... Ar the, the army camo as well. We've got the blacked out squad over here. Fire, you are living dangerously. I mean, if I can't find that, then I'm really done. I I'll give you guys a couple minutes to go and hide. There is your map. Go park within the boundaries, and I'll be up there in a minute or two after I turn off my map and stuff. We begin the clock. Let's go searching 11 people to go and find in this very, very big map. After a couple minutes or so of, I would imagine, not finding anybody, we will go from level 1 to level 2 where the map will shrink. PUBG style. It's very, very cool. Or I guess I should say Apex Legends style. On one hand, it's going to be pretty easy because I'm searching for Mercedes Unimogs and they are literally massive. This area is actually so big. Look at Edinburgh down there. It's massive. And I still don't know my way around it very well. I mean, I genuinely don't know how long this is going to take. It's going to be a good one. If I was a Unimog, where would I go and hide? That's my question. Like, you can't really hide in many areas. It's such a big vehicle. I don't really know where you would put one of these. I mean, people can drive around, right? So... They could do that. I will be honest, I'm kind of surprised that we haven't been able to find a Unimog yet. Any Unimogs hiding at- um, <laughs> Okay. Okay. What is going on with these spawns? I was looking at this thing, I'm like, I see one! Nope, it's just a tow truck. Ah. Sit rep, after all of that time, I'm back where I started. God damn it. I genuinely didn't think that this would be so difficult. Hold on. I can actually come way, way out here. Oh, <gasps> yes! Yep! Yeah, oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Things didn't go well, but I found somebody! We're down to 10! Why did I make this map so big? I must have driven past that guy before as well, and I just didn't notice. All right, well, that is the end of round number one, lads. The zone is changing up a little bit. I'm gonna put five more minutes on the clock and you guys are gonna have your zone shrunken. It's gonna go from looking like that to looking like that. Shrinks up a little bit everywhere, tightens up. You gotta be in Edinburgh properly. No more off-roading. That should make my life quite a bit easier, I'm just gonna say. I'm back to the question now. If I was a Unimog, where would I hide? Like, there's not- there's not many places for a Unimog in the- t in- in Edinburgh. It's just- it's just not possible to keep one of these things a secret. Nope, nobody there. Nick, check the train tracks. That is a good idea. I'm actually gonna start- this is actually the last time we played hide and seek! Yes! Oh my god, what the hell? I was just meant to say the last time we played hide and seek, we found somebody here. And it is the same once again. All right, on the train tracks. Oh, is that somebody down at the end? I think it is. Is it just one person or is it a couple? It is. Oh. 
Well, that's a clippy point. That's gonna be one person in the Unimog down on the train tracks. Thank you for the person in Twitch chat who reminded me that. We are down to eight. Suddenly, with just a little bit of a smaller map, it finally starts to come together. Look at that. Wool says I drove past him a few times in his old spot. No way. DJ says our old spot was mint at a at Wolf's. The pink Unimog is OP. Watch. I guarantee you the pink Unimog is going to last to the end. There are so many little off-road places. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, what is that area? I've never seen this before. What is this? A little secret little path? Yo. That's been five minutes already? I'm just saying, if there was somebody parked down there, I never, ever, ever would have found you. We're going from level two down to level three with another five minutes on the clock. Here is your new zone. We are going to the north side of Edinburgh. Everybody in Twitch chat is like, God damn it, again? I still can't believe that there's eight of them in the tiny little area that we've given them. I'm gonna join Discord and we'll see what these guys have to say. So, we're gonna go from the zone looking like that, which was the north side of Edinburgh, shrinks by 50% again. Might as well give them the prize at this point. I seriously don't know how you guys have made eight Unimogs disappear. I was coming into this, I was like, this is gonna be the easiest hide and seek. I'm like, you know the last one when we were doing like the Easter egg hunt? I'm like, that's that would be pretty easy because the zone's so small. This one, it's like the opposite problem. The zone's really big. This park, though, I don't know about that. There's gotta be people. Oh, I've spotted one. Spotted one person in the park already in a matte black one. That's me. Hello, DJ. <laughs> How are there seven uni mods? Oh, uh, make that six. Never mind. Oh, no. Is that you? No, it's another random. I'm still alive. Goodbye, buddy. Fire, I will find your pink uni. I don't know how no, you made no, it survive. You won't. you, you won't. Unless you're like on a roof, you're done. I'm not, I'm not DJ. Okay, so I can is come there on another the... stage? There is another stage, but I don't think you'll like it. Oh, really? It. Yeah, there is. Oh, God. You all need to be in one place. Okay, is everybody just parked down this road? Like that's, that's, that has to be what you've done. I don't understand. I've gone down every road. Like, no, no, you haven't. What do you mean? You all need to be in the same place. It's it's impossible. <laughs> There's no way. I, I, I seriously do not believe that you are all in this game. Everybody's disconnected and I'm just driving around. Okay, I've driven down every road. I have. There, it, you, you can't tell me I've not driven down every road. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what does that mean? Totally not in a peel that says Unimog on the side. You see, that's the type of thing I expect you to pull. I was thinking about doing that, but I, I didn't. It's like two blocks. I've driven down every road. Wolf is like, this is the greatest thing I've ever witnessed. <laughs> yeah, you're witnessing a mental breakdown. I think I have a train of Unimogs following me. You all have to be driving around, like following me, but on the opposite side of the map, like doing the opposite of what I do. That is my only thing I can think of. I could make the map smaller, but I think that would be too easy. Oh! Oh, there's one! I just saw one! I just saw some guy! Where'd he go? He's driving in the middle. Uh, I don't know if he's trying to lead me to someone, but I saw that guy. I don't know if I found him already. I'm, I'm not looking at him. Wait, did I just find somebody? Yeah. Yeah. Well <laughs> Down to five, I think. I don't think your number's accurate. All I know of is... Three. We're down to three. <laughs> what I don't understand is how there's a pink. Uh... Yeah, that's me. Would have been cool to go <laughs> up there. Okay, I guess we'll do it. We'll go to level five. I didn't want to have to resort to this, but apparently we are. Level five. It's literally just the park. <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> There's no way! There's no way you were all in! Everybody's in the zone, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! Zone six is where it's Oh, I see somebody! Back. Who's that? Oh, that's that's nerd. nerd. That's one. Well, he wasn't in the zone! He just whipped yep. it in! He wasn't in the park! Right. Wait, so we're down to two? Yep, yep me and Ink. I don't like the, uh, the silence. Yeah. I I'm in the park. 
I don't believe you. Why? Because I've driven in this park for 30 minutes and it's not that big. It is pretty big. Oh, I see a pink one. What oh. the hell? I see a pink one. <laughs> what the hell? Where'd you go? So you are driving around. I see. Well, I know the strategy now. Y'all just driving on the opposite corner of me, like I said you were doing. How about he is one with the tree? This looks like a bush wacky spot. Can someone? No. Okay. It's a. It's one of those special walking trees, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> oh. What was that? Uh, what was uh, that? The... Oh my <laughs> God! Yeah. <laughs> over an hour that was unbelievable so were you guys just driving around yeah on the opposite side to me the entire time pretty much yeah. <laughs> Ank did drive by you a couple times and didn't you didn't see him i just didn't notice wait so dj where was your really cool spot the thing is i have to drop down onto a location and that's gonna be a pain so that was you and wolf's up there uh, wolf's was a little bit over i was i was here right oh okay yeah i so i drove past you guys as well and I didn't see you up there. If that was actually the final zone, I never, never. Well, boys, thank you for helping out with our hide and seek. I'm surprised that that took so long. <laughs>